Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Uh, today, we are discussing how to read the interconnection. So, paano ka ba magbasa sa interconnection? Let's say, this is the example for the interconnection diagram. But before you proceed reading interconnection, drawing, I will give you an example here how to read. Okay? First of all, this is the example. So this is the drawing. <clears throat> Saudi Arabia or company. So interconnection diagram. So you can see here plot number, index, drawing number, sheet number, and revision. So you, you need to know what is the revision and which location. And exactly the date itself, you need to know the date itself. Okay. So every time if there is a revision comment during the submittal of a drawing, this must be changed. Revision 5. Okay. So also you can see the references. So every design engineer always providing the reference drawing. For example, you have a cable conduit schedule. You can see this drawing number. Electrical installation details, you can see this drawing. Equipment layout, this drawing. Overall piping plan, this drawing. Instrument loop diagram, and this drawing. So that is your references when you are doing cross-checking of, of the drawings. And then you need to provide the notes here terminal numbers, all tax information, interconnection. So this is the information that you need to read first. After that, you need to proceed here. And this is our interconnection. So just for example, we can see here. You can see the dotted line. If you see here, if you can see this one dotted line, so meaning this is belongs to MCC. So MCC panel or else breaker, uh, switch gear, whatever connections connected to the other end. Okay. So FTB, this is terminal. Okay. This is terminal block. You can see. Pell terminal block. Pell start on indication. Indication. When you opening the terminal block, you can see all of this information. And how much the cable? So we have 18. So 18 core by 2.5 mm squared. And this is the cable that you can see in, in the field. Okay. And this MCC001, the wire connected here, that's going to GM. So, okay. GM, which is motor. So, motor, the number of motors here, 113 GM. 0277 and then, then you can see again there's a dotted line okay this is what we call say what we can say here that's a, uh, some other terms battery limit so this is the sort of example of your uh, panel motor switch gear mcc okay so and again there's another terminal block here so one two three that is on of indication so you always familiar and always verifying during your testing inspection both of this end so if terminal one in the other end and terminal one in the other end and gm motor side and then panel side terminal one you can see here ATB1 MCC 001 CC 08 LB MTR1 TB12 and then connected 
also in terminal 1. So that is our cross-reference tag number. So should be the same, must be the same. Okay. And then this is 2 connected here, 3, C3. So terminal 3, this is FTB3. And connected to where? Terminal 7. So that, that's why they're putting here terminal 7 in this area. Okay. And then FTB4 connected to where? FTB4. In TB, TB1, this one, TB1. Okay, TB1, this one. So, for example, TB12, that is connected. TB15, connected 15. 13, connected 13. Okay. And then the other one, example, PTB, so terminal. So what he's telling here, repair to drawing 696552. So you need to find out where is that? See? 696552. He is repairing this drawing, 696552 instrument loop diagram so you need to go there check the instrument loop diagram and you can see this terminal okay so another interconnection okay this is the same another mcc01 So connected to motors, okay? So this is the example of our interconnection drawing. So this is the tag number. This is the payroll number. Payroll in the both ends, MCC and to EM. Okay, motor side. Okay, for, from the load side. Okay, and then another one. This is transformer. So transformer does 301 MCC. And then the supply transformer funds RYBN. This is red, yellow, blue, and N. It is neutral. Okay. And then this is the payroll. And cross references, okay. They have a cross reference TBR, TBR is 301. This one is transformer 301. So, meaning this is coming from transformer 301. This one, okay. This is the one, and then PC 8061. So, where that's coming from, that is this tag number okay and then mcc 201 this is mcc 201 so this is cross references of your payroll so when you go visit in this uh, area mcc this panel for example you can check this and you you need to understand that this wire is going to transformer or transformer going to MCC. So that is feeder compartment, feeder compartment 2G. So you can found that one in the compartment feeder 2G. Okay. And then an initiator panel, also the same. So you can locate that in power panel PP001. Okay, this terminal. And then the other one, CB. You can pound that one in the CB. Circuit breaker and neutral CT. 
So this is all information for our interconnection. And always remember that is the equipment name, okay? 00, AP001, and then, for example, other one, PP001, this is our equipment name, okay? So you must, you must know what is the abbreviation of your equipment, okay? You need to be familiar. Anyway, there is a scope of work or uh, specifications, and they mention all of this information. Like, for example, PP, that is power panel, MCC, switch gear, transformer, motors, okay? And, for example, this one, spectator. And then from here, from MCC, the wire of this connected to PLC refer to 589649. Again, you need to check the references. So this is instrument loop diagram, okay? That's all how you uh, verify and check your drawings and reading the instrument interconnection diagram. So instrumentation diagram, electrical diagram. So you must be familiar, okay? So this is all the information that I am giving right now for how you do reading of our interconnection. You must know how to read. So for the newcomers in the engineering or newcomers or the inspections and how to read the drawings and you must be familiar. And check some of other information that I already uploaded here and you can check and verify so that you will understand. So what is all about design, engineering, inspections, these things, everything, it's here, okay? And have a nice day.